Mega Key Silver Age comic ready to be unboxed. If you want to know what it is, and my cat is here ready to watch with us, just stick around. Go, go subscribe to We Love Comics. We love, and we do, we love comics. This video is sponsored by PGX Grading Services. Get one free pressing of your choice when you grade 10 with the code We Love Comics Free Press. Link in description. What is up, my fellow comic book collectors? My name is Chris, and this is my channel, We Love Comics, and I have a Silver Age key that I want to first get the cat from blocking that I want to open up for you guys. And I always want to tell everybody, make sure you wait until the end to see who's today's surprise subscriber shout out. And if you want one, all you have to do is, oh, wow, that, that was easy for once, be a subscriber and uh, you could get them. Just keep in mind, it does take a little while. So this is Silver Age Key book. This is my fourth copy of this book. All right, so it looks like they put some protection, a lot of backing boards around it, so that's always good. Um, this is a key issue book. This is my fourth copy of this book. Uh, it's a lower grade, but you know, like I say, low grade is better than no grade. This is definitely a book I've been recommending for a long time. Um, the book is getting up there. But you ain't seen nothing yet, so if you have not had the opportunity to get this book, please get it while you can, because after they are announced in a Marvel movie, officially, these books are going to double and triple what they are now, so get them while you can. So, without further ado, this cat, as soon as I turn on the camera, this cat comes running. He's such a ham, and all of a sudden he wants attention. I could be here all day just sitting here doing nothing. He won't come near me, but as soon as I start talking with the camera, he just comes running out of nowhere. So some of you care, some of you don't give a rat's behind. So there is the book. This is, of course, Fantastic Four, issue number 48, which is the first full appearance of the Silver Surfer and the first cameo appearance of Galactus, two major characters in the Marvel Cinematic Universe, and that's where they are headed. Um, this book, the cover is detached, and there is some tape, so this, the highest this could get is around probably a 2.0, but I paid the price of a 0 0.5, so I, I, this is definitely a spec book. I love this book, love this cover, didn't have this book when I was a kid, now own four copies, so this will eventually get graded, and, um, like I said, if you can always find deals. So even key issue books, you can find good deals on. So with shipping and handling, um, where is the price? I paid a total of $356, and that's with $11 for shipping and handling. So considering they put it in an envelope, um, that's a little disappointing how much they charge me for the shipping. I mean, for $11, that thing should have been in a box. And uh, this cat is just getting way too excited right now. So, yeah, this is definitely a book I highly recommend. It does show that even with key issues, you can get pretty good deals. Because if you go on GoCollect.com, um, this book in a 0 0.5 goes for about that price. So I know this book is only going to continue to go up from here. So, again, I have two 5.0s. I have one that's probably a 2.5. And this one's going to be the lowest one. But considering the value of this comic, uh, it's just going to continue to go up. Because eventually you're going to see Silver Surfer and hopefully a cloudless Galactus in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. I highly doubt they would make that same mistake as what Fox did. But I guess we'll see if they learn from their other people's mistakes. I don't think they'll do it. So um, there are rumors that Galactus might be in Avengers 4. Um, who knows at this point, there's been a lot of a speculation, so take that with a grain of salt. But if you can get this book, even in a 0 0.5, get it, because I can almost assure, obviously there's no guarantee, but when they show up in a Marvel movie, uh, these books will at least double. So get them before they get out of reach. I know it's out of reach for some, but if you could pick up a 0 0.5 for 300 and it turns into a $600 book, hey, you know, that's still, that's a good profit to make if you're a person that likes to sell them. So far, I have multiple copies. Like I said, this is my fourth. And there are some people who ask, well, why do you have so many copies? For the plain reason of, number one, I love collecting. And when you collect, you can't get enough. I mean, nobody buys one stock, you know, <laughs> one thing of stock. And uh, when they collect, people collect coins, they don't just buy one coin. 
They tend to get multiples of the same one if they can get it, especially at good prices. But for me, if I ever want to get, because eventually I want to trade some of my key issue books, combine them to get an Amazing Fantasy 15. Now, I love this book. If I only had one copy of this book, well, then it would be a lot harder to trade because we all know we get attached to these things, especially if we bought them when we were kids or there was a nostalgic reason for it or just because we couldn't get it as a kid and now we can afford it as we get older, we tend to be attached. So if I only had one copy, it would be a lot harder to trade or sell. But if I have multiple copies, like I said, this is my fourth copy. So if I traded three of them, well, I still have it. So it's a way to get other books that you want and not lose out on a comic you may love because a lot of people end up with, you know, seller's remorse when they sell a comic maybe for, you know, to pay a bill or whatever and end up not having it anymore and you miss it. So that's why I recommend that for myself and anybody that wants to do the same thing. Obviously, it's going to be different for each person. So my cat, for some reason, of all the areas of his body, he likes to show his rear end. I don't know why. I guess he's flashing my trolls. So that's for the trolls, but they're not watching as far anyway. So anyway, give it a thumbs up if you can. Hit subscribe if you haven't. Uh, if you want to share it, I always appreciate that. Hit the notification button. Don't forget to wait until the end to see who's today's surprise subscriber shout out. If you want one, just ask for one, and I'll be more than happy to put one in your name. It just may take a while. So if you've been waiting a while, let me know. I will try and move you up. So that's it. So thanks for watching. Hope you appreciate it. And don't forget, it's not you. It's not I. It's We Love Comics, and who knew a person in a dress would look so cool? Thank you for watching my video. If you want to connect with me on Facebook, just click right here. If you want to join our cashback program and get $10 off your first purchase of $25 or more, click here. And then if you aren't subscribed, we'd love you to join by clicking here.